Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. On March 26, 2024, the European Union made public its allocation of over 130 million euros to the German corporation Rheinmetall, as part of its initiative to bolster artillery ammunition production capacities. This financial backing is part of a larger 500 million euro package established under the Act of Support in Ammunition Production, ASAP, aimed at enhancing the production of 155 mm artillery ammunition and powder within the EU's defense infrastructure. The funds will be distributed across six projects managed by Rheinmetall AG subsidiaries in Germany, Hungary, Romania, and Spain. This development forms a crucial component of the ASAP initiative, representing the EU's inaugural program aimed at expanding ammunition production capabilities within member states. The formal procedures to initiate this funding will commence with the signing of grant agreements, scheduled for May 2024. Armin Papperger, CEO of Rheinmetall AG, provided insight into the funding, recognizing the EU's decision to invest in Rheinmetall as a significant supplier of 155mm ammunition. He emphasized the evolving global defense landscape, citing examples such as Ukraine to underscore the heightened importance of artillery in contemporary conflicts. Papperger also stressed the necessity for European armed forces to bolster their artillery ammunition supplies and confirmed Rheinmetall's plans to ramp up production. Since 2022, Rheinmetall has been actively enhancing its manufacturing capabilities. For instance, the company's role as a supplier for the Ukrainian armed forces is expected to expand following Rheinmetall AG's recent acquisition of all shares in the Spanish company Expel Systems SAU. This acquisition enables Rheinmetall to offer a wide range of medium and large caliber ammunition, including 20mm automatic cannon rounds for the Martyr Infantry Fighting Vehicle, 35mm ammunition for the Jeopard Anti-Aircraft Vehicle, and 105mm and 120mm tank ammunition for the Leopard 1 and Leopard 2 main battle tanks, MBTs. The acquisition broadens Rheinmetall's involvement in its core business areas of weapons, ammunition, and propellants. Through integration into Rheinmetall Expo munitions, the company gains access to additional artillery and mortar rounds, medium-caliber ammunition, fuses, and rocket propulsion systems, thereby expanding its presence in the global ammunition market. Additionally, the acquisition of Expo provides Rheinmetall with enhanced production capabilities, including access to facilities in Spain and an expansion into the demilitarization and soil remediation sector in the United States. By 2027, the Rheinmetall Group aims to achieve an annual production capacity of up to 1.1 million artillery shells. Additionally, plans are in place to commence annual production of up to 1.5 million propellant modules and 3,000 tons of RDX explosives starting in 2026. These endeavors underscore Rheinmetall's response to the increased global demand for artillery ammunition, driven by rising requirements for military equipment in various countries and escalating geopolitical tensions. The EU's financial backing to Rheinmetall is part of a broader strategy to strengthen defense capabilities among its member states. Furthermore, the European Union has outlined future plans for supporting the defense sector through its proposal for a European Defense Investment Program, EDIP, aimed at promoting the expansion of production capacities for various defense products. This represents a systematic approach to enhancing the military preparedness and response capabilities of EU member states. The Act in Support of Ammunition Production, ASAP, is a European initiative aimed at augmenting ammunition production capacity within Europe. This initiative is a response to the European Council's directive in March 2023 for the urgent provision of ammunition and missiles to Ukraine and for EU member states to replenish their stocks. ASAP addresses challenges and shortages within defense supply chains, with projects exceeding a total budget of 500 million euros across five areas, 124 million euros for explosives, 248 million euros for powder, 90 million euros for shells, 50 million euros for missiles, and 2 million euros for testing and reconditioning certification. ASAP serves as part of the European Council's three-track ammunition strategy, specifically focusing on the industrial component to enhance production capabilities. The program aims to improve the EU's defense industry's capacity to meet demands for timely ammunition and missile supplies by implementing specific measures and providing financial support through grants aimed at boosting production capacities and mitigating supply chain issues. The European Commission has identified 31 projects to receive funding under ASAP, distributing a total of 500 million euros. 
These projects cover areas including explosives, powder, shells, missiles, and testing and reconditioning, with the goal of increasing the output and preparedness of the European defense industry. The allocated funds are intended to attract additional investment from the industry, estimated to bring total investment to around 1.4 billion euros, aimed at enhancing production capacity and readiness. The objectives of ASAP include supporting the EU's defense industry in expanding manufacturing capacities, ensuring the security of supply and availability of essential inputs, facilitating access to finance for defense firms, and addressing production bottlenecks for accelerated delivery. This initiative aligns with the EU's overarching policy to support Ukraine and reinforce the Union's defense capabilities, aiming to solidify the European defense industrial and technological base while meeting the immediate demands for defense products. That's all for now, see you later.